hey everybody and welcome back to Dishonored 2. Now, I know we're not where we were in the last episode because we didn't get to do the briefing or anything like that because my dumbass forgot to click the record button in OBS. So unfortunately, we're right here now. At the beginning of the mission, the only thing is when it comes to the briefing is um, we're in a place called Karnaka. We're going to the Admire Station, which is where... Welcome to Karnaka, stranger. Thank you for the welcome, sir. I don't know how you live in a dump like this. There's literally blood pouring out of there, blood pouring over here, there's a dead whale over there. Like, it's just not a very fun place to be. But back to what I was saying. Yeah, this is where Corvo grew up, and we gotta go to Adamire Station, and we gotta travel up to a medical institution, which is where we're gonna supposedly find the Crown Killer, as well as the location of our good old dear friend, Sokolov. But before we do any of that, we gotta go to the black market because I want to be able to. Hello, sir. Yeah, I want to get some sleep darts and just stock up on some stuff. And the black market is essentially my thing to do that. You are actually a key part of making this a very short episode. My name's episode. Mindy Blanchard. Shut up, Mindy. But yeah, what she does is actually turn off the power to the rails and a little bit down uh, the line. It allows us to run right the past like a whole room full of people. So it's actually really really helpful uh but yeah Ooh, we do not have a lot of money okay give me one second guys and problem solved right there now we have more money yeah we're just gonna stock up on everything come back soon all righty problem I mean, solved so I'm still here you'll most likely be here now you can actually rob the black Means market in this game which say. is actually pretty nice they should do like but there's me. nothing in there Never that i it. need right now outside of you know Maybe some more sleep darts, but I already at max capacity, so I really don't care. So yeah. A few blood flies stop us. I'm gonna take this dude's body. What does it say? Nope, don't really care. Wee! Yeah, we're we're not gonna deal with the, the blood eggs. flies. Blood flies are just annoying. Like the first time I played through this game ever, those Everyone's blood flies were the bane of my existence. My so yeah. Wee! Oh, I love Far Reach for that. Just upgrading Far Reach for that ability alone, totally worth it. But I actually want to save the dude down there. So what we're gonna do is, okay, maybe not that way. I'm gonna do a little number like that. Do a little number like this. And put a sleep dart. And again, this is why I love having infinite magic because it's just. Guess what yeah. happens next? Come on. Oh, he still died. Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm just killing them both next time. Ah, oh, that's so dumb. The guards live, but the person I was trying to save didn't. That's lame. But yeah, that's why I like having infinite magic, because then I can do stuff like that, and it feels a lot more, I guess, entertaining to watch than just, you know, having to skulk around like a little gremlin. Now, the one thing I hate about this section is these stupid-looking civilians. They're not exactly stupid-looking. But it's a case of... Oh, I hit you in the helmet. Whoopsies! Yeah, these, these... You fucking sneeze in the wrong direction around these people. They run away screaming, Help! Help! There's a madman! Yeah! Bitch, I am a normal civilian just like everybody else. I know there's people on their way. Yeah. I don't think anybody from the far left over there is actually coming after me, which is good. I think it's just this guy. Okay, the music stopped. Okay, thank God. I was not about to have to fucking deal with everybody over there. Not yet, at least. More blood flies. Yay. Yeah, I know there's a thing in there, but uh, I don't want to fuck around and find out with that, so we're not going to do Grand that. Soldiers. Best to you might see me, actually. Oh, I probably should get me and, you know, boost up my health. Um, let's see here. I could... Okay, no, I do not want to use that. I could pull him up here once he walks back that direction. But if I pull you, you're going to see. And if I knock you out, your face is going to hit that. And you're going to die. Because I believe that's a generator. Okay, yeah. I think I'll just wait for him to walk past him. We're probably just going to go ahead and do a little number like this. Please don't walk back over here in the meantime. Just go unconscious, go to sleep. And then we'll sneak around. I don't think he turns around at all, so. Oh shit, I forgot. 
Please just go unconscious, please. Okay. You aren't going anywhere. Nope, nope, but you guys are going somewhere. If you swing at me, you're gonna kill him, and then it's gonna be your fucking problem. No bounties being collected today on my head, at least. And I think, uh, please tell me since he was unconscious beforehand, I don't, he doesn't count as a death. Oh, thank God. Okay, everyone's taking a sleepy sleep. That's fine. But yeah, we got to collect a dead body for Miss Mindy over there in order to complete this. So, yeah. Can I get in through up there? Oh, well, I could go across. I guess that beats trying to deal with the guards. Okay, sure. Now, I do also have Blink as well, which I think is good for more precise uh, teleportations because I do I do love far reach, especially being able to pull something to me. But a lot of times when you shoot somewhere like can catapult you, almost like a, a hook, like a hook shot more so than it does. Shut the hell up, sir. Yoink. Yoink. Now, I kind of want to... What do I want to do here? Probably just sleep, darling. Yeah, it's probably a better option. I was say, the only one who knows the sleep darts in this game are... Excuse me? What the fuck killed him? I'm trying to be non-lethal. I am trying. That is a spring razor. Okay, yeah. So the game doesn't want me to be non-lethal, apparently. Apparently it's just murder, murder, murder. What? You don't care that this magical being of freak nature just happened to pop up a thing? He doesn't give a shit. That man is dead. That man right there is about as dedicated as your boss wants you to be at your current job. I cannot believe he just doesn't give a shit. Sir? Did I not kill you? Oh, I mean, I don't want to... I mean... I'll take this. I mean, I, I don't want to... Are you serious? How do I do this without killing the man? Well, I, I suppose the good way to do it would just be... Yoink! Don't guess he died. I tried so hard for the people over there. God. Can I please not kill people? My lord. I, I'm, okay, you guys at least know that I'm trying. I have evidence that I'm trying. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's try this mesmerized thing again. Let me see if it's a little bit inconsistent or if it's just me. Okay, there's, ah, uh, yeah, it worked. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys, but I did have to answer that. Are you waiting for me? I don't know how long this lasts, but which one of you has the key? Because I could, because that's the body I need. Yeah. We're gonna try to just actually no, we're gonna domino affect you guys. And this is the quickest way to knock somebody out, so. Uh, oh, I need the key. Uh you didn't have the key. You did have the key, because I don't want to smash the window, I'll just trigger the people down there. Alright, sir. That's Come it. On. The body Mindy sent me after. <laughs> okay. And oh, there's another guard, damn it. Got more sleep darts? I do. There we go. Okay, we're gonna actually use bling to get down from here because I'm not about to fling myself a million miles. Okay. Now I think if I just run, I can make it down to mini before anybody gets scared or runs away. I already lost that fucking the second I started running with a dead body. Here's your body. Put it down. I'm not being gentle with it. God, you're so ugly. So now you've been paid. Hit the road. Mm, I want to kill you so bad because of that. But let's yeah, she turned off the train. That train that's coming through right now, yeah, she turned that off. So yeah. Uh-oh. What bro, I'm all the way down the street. If, if you think I'm hightailing it towards you, you're mistaken. You see what I mean? Are you kidding me? You know what, bitch? Uh no, I wanna go up here. And then go go up here. And then I could ride this train all the way down. Touch the carriage rails now. Yeah. So let me actually hop up here real quick. Because all this area right here. Actually, let me go ahead and Whee! Yeah, all of that right there, past that arc wall or whatever the hell it is, 
is just full of people and problems that I do not care to deal with. But yeah, then we can just hop in here and head all the way over to the medical institution. Yeah, Ademeyer Institute, that's what it's called. Click. I do love that they added a bit more animation into this towards the end and it wasn't just so cut and dry. It makes it feel so much more fresher. God, I love this game. But yeah, so since this doesn't take us back to the ship and since this is the end of the mission, I'm actually going to end this video here. A little bit of a short one, I know. Next one, it'll hopefully be a little longer. But we've kind of went towards the non-lethal here and towards the stealth option. We kind of got it. You know, overall chaos, I think, is still pretty low. I'm not sure where exactly it tells me that. Uh, ruins, I don't care. Fresh grave, yes. Okay, so we did everything. Uh, but yeah, with, with that being said, let me know how you guys feel about the series so far down in the comments. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'll, oops, I'm sorry. I'll see y'all in the next one.